Um, I absolutely uh, agree with those who believe he should spend the next rest of his natural life in Ashworth High Security Prison. He's been manipulating everybody for nearly 50 years. He's manipulated and controlled his victims and he shouldn't win the last round of what is a macabre game of chess. His only pawn is knowing the whereabouts of Keith Bennett's body. And when he loses that pawn, he's checkmated and he's not going to reveal it, so let him stay where he is. Well, it's a matter for the judge to decide. His case is that he's not insane. Unfortunately, I have to agree. I've interviewed him on a number of occasions. And whilst he's a cold-blooded murderer, my wife and I, who both saw him, came to the conclusion that he's not insane. He's entirely rational. But I hope he doesn't get out because I say that is so upsetting and dreadful for all the victims who suffered at his hands.